it's Chris here and welcome back to Mono Lords. Right, let's see how we are sheep is going on. Our five little uh, five, yeah. I was thinking somehow we missed one by some reason, but no, everything is fine. We have very big bush growing out of nowhere on the road. We probably can get rid of that. Yeah, last episode what we done we got for ourselves nice little level 3 house over there this big boy over here Look how nicely she's rising up near the market style in town center right uh, how we doing with the food that was our problem we have some berries vegetables are sticking around barely I would say and we are still not getting any house upgrades in this area yeah it's probably I think we have to do another granary I'm not sure about that or maybe we can increase this one to be honest we will get more people to work with I'm not sure but we can try let's put that put on highest we need five timber ten planks and five stone 5 timber, 10 planks and 5 stone. Yeah, stone we have plenty of. We'll see how that goes. We could also upgrade this one to be honest. I'm not sure if we if we need more oxen maybe. What that guy is doing? What you doing? Show me. Oh, it's trader I believe. Okay. Yeah, we will run out of wood as well. But we have some trees growing here nicely, as I see. People and they still planting. So looking for planting spot. And one is planting. Sun. Sun is going and doing some job nicely. Very good job, big boy. Keep going. I don't want, obviously, I want get rid of that wood because we need our berries and we need our animals over there yeah I'm not sure where we're gonna move that logging camp to be honest <laughs> limit working area it's already quite limited I would say we could move it let's let's move it over here let's see what happens Let's ask them to go over there. It's a little bit of a traveling, but I don't want them move the logging up closer. That it will be much tra. It it's traveling either way, so we're gonna leave it as it is over there, I believe. Berries are growing back, obviously, because they don't have space, I believe. Yes, they don't have space. <laughs> when we can't upgrade this forager hut as well. Well, yeah. okay, it's fine. Uh, to, to, to how you with money we do have nice little money over there 16 veggies so I I assume we actually getting better because we are harvesting as I oh yeah we are harvesting some veggies that's good not all in once but we are doing that so we have four households over there with veggies and five six seven eight eight households all together with wedges that's not too bad okay let's go back to our gold hof and check what's cooking over here okay one house is already up that's nice let's speed up thingies a little bit we have one family and six families doing some work somewhere else that's fine good Let's get these houses up. Okay. Two houses, that's nice. So we have one, two, three more over there. Okay, cool. We have four without. Yeah, that's fine. We should get now, now it's June. We're approaching June, so we should get one extra family now. We do have plenty of firewood. Not much, not much food though. 
But now we're getting one extra family. We're gonna ask all of them to quickly get these two more houses then, three overall, and then we're gonna cr construct a, a forager hut to get them to go and get some berries because it's already June so we have to go and start to harvest them. Right, I could actually construct one of those already, so we have berries very far away, which is here somewhere. I'm gonna put that forager hut around about here. We're gonna leave that in for medium for now. How many berries we have? Resource stolen by nearby bandits. These little buggers over there. We could go and get though them asses kicked but I think I I don't want to do that yet let's le let's leave them for now let's concentrate a little bit on our old hof over here we're getting some honey as I see honey is delivered to the marketplace to the wood stall I believe yep one honey yay <laughs> and one honey is gone straight away so somebody probably took it Interesting. Okay, so this we can increase to high as well straight away. The house will be done already. Yep, that's fine. So we have four, five households. Will be six already without families. That's good. We're gonna leave them there. And then we're gonna start and construct something else. We are going up with our approval rating, 53%. That's fine. We was nearly freaking half a year without any going up, so but now it's going up. We are happy people. Right, what we'll be able to place down. Timber is so far so good, I would say. Ice week families families moving on in. It's fine. I think this will be the last episode of Manor Lords. I've kind of a little bit messed up our situation here. I didn't even think how to sort our village. So I think I'm gonna wait for more upgrades and something. I, I, I still feel that something is missing. Something is a little bit glitching around. Oh, we do have our granary ready so we can add more families that's what no we're gonna remove them for now and I think these families yes so people unassigned move them here I think should be this one over there okay All these unassigned people gonna go... Oh, that one is Forager. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I think three only. Yeah, so three can be there. Okay, good. So now, we should be able... So these dudes should be able to go and collect things from all. No space left for production hunting camp. Uh, let's close that. Okay, um, with that being said, I think we're gonna build another hunting camp over here. Increase the highest priority. Build that one up. Uh, sadly, we can't upgrade this. Yeah, so penetry is going, so berries are going down, so looks like granary worker is already collecting those from the forager hut. So that's how it's supposed to be. So these, these forager hunters, they shouldn't be with the uh, market stalls. Granary workers should be with the market stalls and they should collect stuff from the hunter camps and all these places where food is coming out and all other stuff. So that's how it should work. Alright, we got some. We, got, we, we are getting all the time money in, so let's see if we we don't need to cancel like export. So 
this one is already on the limit that's fine so maybe let's do no trade for now actually we could leave trade and we could just increase the amount I believe um, we could sell some shoes to be honest but oh 240 costs I don't I I'm not gonna do it yet I believe malt is all right firewood export is one wow we could sell oh we need as well trade route oh well looks like we won't sell anything I believe oh we are back up on quite a good amount of food but I don't think we're gonna keep it that way because we won't get wedges here lately I believe so we do have now food stall for these guys so they they oh this these are not they have nothing I think the market market is for them too far away I think that will be the problem so in probably next season when I'm gonna do next season I will need to concentrate put that put this market somewhere let's say here and then all around I need to do buildings and houses and stuff like that otherwise this yeah this is not gonna work well also we need logs all the time they are not growing quick that quickly back how I, how I actually imagine that they are growing nicely here but it takes freaking years so yeah okay let's go back to Goldhof our little nice small town what cooking here guys why are we not finishing the freaking house two families are on come on we can do this okay so that's done and now let's get going where is our forager hut we need to get that one done so that will be increased now that's stone deposit okay little houses over there so we can put straight away one family in there food for nine months food is our well we have only meat <laughs> so that's not ideal we should probably now try and make the big families so I think what I'm gonna do I'm gonna make big houses over here construction houses we could go from here six houses I would say why the freaking not or maybe we could do different way we could do five a little bit efficient or even four with some extra family spaces so that would be one two three four houses I would go for five maybe or maybe actually four for extra family no let's go for well let's go for five but we're gonna leave that on medium the priority for now we need to finish quickly do the forager place over there we need that one Honey, honey, we have only one honey. I th probably think we will need to build more of these because one honey, they producing one honey, that's definitely not enough. One is already there, one family is collecting it. Okay, we're gonna leave that one for now, probably. We could technically take off woodcutters people for now, or we could take them off in the winter time and then why springtime add those people again there we could just make as much as we can f full fuel now and then on the winter time just just cut it for a little bit we'll see we wait for june we need another family so they should move in there and then we're gonna go like this probably
Okay. Not much we can probably do here. We can only wait for them to finish. They're not far away actually, to be honest. So let's speed up things a little bit over here. Let's just wait for them to finish. New mercenary companies. Okay, so next month is coming up. July is here. New family is moving in. Nice. Three families already there. Okay, so that's finished. And we can... We can add one family to do berries for us. Nice. Okay, we have two families without any work, so that means let's increase to these plots on the highest priority. How much we have? Timber, timber 30, 78 planks, 10 stone, okay. I would say we probably need to get rid of this one, as I want to build houses around. Obviously, won't go very far deep in the in the woods. We're gonna probably go down a little bit with those, but market probably market a little bit too small. But we can always get rid of that road, I believe, somehow. Cancel? No. Do, 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 do. Remove road. Alt. Oh. Okay, yeah, so we can. In in case of something we can always move upper somewhere else and then cancel the road and increase or add another marketplace over there. So that's an option. Heights. Yeah, we'll need uh, we need to now construct these places. We need to get families and do some garden stuff so by garden I probably need we will need definitely I think we will need to put one family more in here otherwise I think otherwise this oh this family or they will they gonna do the market style we don't need that yeah so let's add another another family in there At least we can try maybe this this town do better than Icewick. <laughs> A little bit at least. How are we doing? Oh so they constructing that first. Okay. Let's prioritize that on the highest. Let's bring this down to medium where are they going to this one okay we're gonna leave that one then to highest and then they can build how what how the, however they want <laughs> okay first house is getting done nice good job second one is going up as well we can put third one on highest as well. Yep. And this one as well. Ah, we can put all of them actually on highest, doesn't matter. One family doing the job, cool. Right. They are getting berries as well, that's good. Honey coming in nicely. Oh, honey obviously, not concentrating on that. That one will be, it will take time. Right, how are we doing with those? I would probably... Yeah, we will need to add one more person in there. Because we are not getting these done at all, I believe. Berries are going down nicely, to be honest. We'll get them down anyway, nicely. Right, we are getting one more family in. Nice. Where they are moving? They are moving here. Oh, here. Okay. Four more. I think I'm gonna add that family straight away to the granary. Because that will be necessary. Yeah. 
and then the next family which will join we can add that to hunting camp to get those resources stolen by bandits we're gonna add probably to the hunting camp I believe come on guys let's get these houses done we have two left half just left to do and then we're gonna probably leave the building for now uh, house building we will probably build something else what we really need let's see well, probably church would be not bad idea to be honest yeah not sure just where I think we are in an angle like this so probably best option for church church <laughs> church would be somewhere around here I would do like this in angle maybe like this over here I would put it there houses are done isn't it yeah, they all done. Cool. Right. Road. Let's do it that way. Um, we could do road. I think I'm gonna do this way. this way and then we can put some houses small ones obviously inside we lead them this to build on pretty high not very high we 10 stone 20 planks yeah they have they have plenty of time to do it no rush okay Looks not bad to be honest. I like it. Okay, so only one person. Oh, you know what? We could probably remove one family from here and put one more in there. Okay. Right, let's go back to Icewick, see what's cooking over here. We have a warehouse of fully loaded with people. And here as well. Okay, and how are we doing with food? Minus one meat. Yeah, so everything is now probably gonna go down <laughs> again. But they have wedges though, so these families they should actually waiting. They are waiting for something. So that means they already harvest everything or what? Because that's like I mentioned in previous episode, I think it's not very efficient I would say if you can get only one wedgie out of one family one household that's not gonna work you need so many households to produce so much food then that would be crazy okay that place is done to 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 Where we have two families, we have families there. They are jointners, they all are jointners. Okay. Unassigned one, okay. Oh, but they are doing some wedges as well. Very small amount. You know what? Let's demolish that. And you guys can go and do some hunting for us. Where else we have two families? Here. 
Step right up and sample. Okay, where else we have two families? Here as well. They both blacksmith. Okay, that's fine. Here as well we have two families. No, one family. Oh, it's level two. Sorry. <laughs> there is four families. Yeah, yeah, I checked that one. They all are joint us. Nice. So I believe that's it with two families. So yeah, we're not getting these done, so... I'm gonna allocate you, my friends. Or maybe we just need one family? 41. No, let's allocate two families, we'll see how that goes. All berries are gone, yeah, I know. 60 just... That was supposed to be big deposit, but because we destroyed some trees over here, it didn't really help us so yeah okay what else not much we can actually do to be honest we could go and do open castle planner and do something around here but I, I, I have a feeling that I put that manor in wrong place as well <laughs> yeah, basically this town is not very looking good I to be honest I like this little bit better but well we'll see we have no berries as at all anymore Ooh, that means they th I think they didn't collect everything I think it's just August crops grow possible droughts to to harvesting plowing and sowing I think yeah I think August might be even too late for berries so we done it a little bit late, I think. I have a feeling. Oh well. Right, back to back to Ice Week. What's happening in here? How are we doing with actually malt ale? So we have only one family, which is here, they are doing, they are brewers. Warehouse workers, okay. I need probably small houses again up to get constructed. But anyway, this will be the last episode for, for, for this series and so not much we can actually do anymore I believe so we'll see I'm gonna wait for more up updates we'll see how it grows up and then we're gonna do season 2 for sure for this game and fingers cro crossed will be a little bit better my planning town planning and stuff like that so yeah I wanna get this town a little bit more working so my placement here was very bad of the logging camp I think we didn't get so much wood as well we do have this circle over there growing back and we are getting rid of some of the wood over there yeah but hopefully for next series we will be a little bit efficient and a little bit better so I will probably increase our difficulty as well we'll see how that goes ice uh, gold hoff is quite okay so they are growing good, but well, it is what it is, so... Right! What we gonna do? We gonna leave... Episode and series over here. Let's... Let's go down on the roads, let's see. We still have wedges coming up. Let's go and see people garden, so... We do have some wedges coming up. But that, like I said, if that's one unit from one household, that's completely not enough. So yeah, right. You, if you're new, please subscribe. You can also go and check another playlist what I have, another series of games what I'm doing, uh, and there will be more, definitely more new games coming out as well. So new, new simulations. Do I, I want to do driving games? So we'll see how driving games going up. We'll see. Maybe I'll find something for you, 
for those and yeah so coolio um please like as well obviously if you have something to say please put your comment down below and coolio i'm i'm gonna leave series and episode over here so thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you in the next one